What is up, ladies and gentlemen? CJ the Cheese DJ here, and we're back with another Lost Island Hardcore episode for you guys today. And today, guys, I figured it's time we try and set up a base spot. Now, we're pretty much just up the mountainside here from where we tamed up the Dinopithecuses, and there's, there's a nice little spot that looks like it's just over there. You can kind of see the, the water, and I think it might be that castle. So I'm going to head over there. We're going to try and bring these guys with us if our Iguanodon can stop get, like getting stuck for just like two seconds, mate. Uh, we're going to head over to that area because I feel like this could probably be a decent base spot. So I thought we'd try our luck and see what's out over there because we've already got our Dinopithecuses here. The only real things we have at that other area is, well, I guess Cinemacropses and all the metal. And that, like, that's it. So if we can find a decent base boss, base spot out here with like metal and all the resources and stuff like that that we need, then we should be pretty sweet. But I want to see what's at the center of this because I know there's like a castle surrounded by water and I'm not entirely sure if this is it. Also, there's probably no dinos at the moment because we have done a dino wipe just to get the new high levels spawning in. Okay, we got a Tyranodon here. Actually, what level are you? Level 20. Get out of you, punk. These guys hit really hard. I've really been loving our Dinopithecuses. They're bloody awesome. Look at this guy. Love him. He's so much fun to ride around on. And uh, they, they appear to take reduced fall damage as well. We're missing one. We're missing a monkey. Where's he gone? Uh, but yeah, he's only going to get stronger. See, they, they stop following you. It's weird when you start attacking stuff. Uh, they're only going to get stronger because we can put helmets on them. So that they that's that's their armor source. So these guys can get like flak helmets and ride helmets with like the bloody super high armor value and stuff like that, and you should be fine. Okay. We've got some mountains here, some cliff faces. I just want to see if there's any metal around here. Which doesn't really look like it. Whether or not that's a problem remains to be seen. Let's take a look at what's actually just through here. Is it just a river? Circling this entire midsection. Is that all it is? If so, I'm going to be slightly disappointed. I was... I'm not going to lie, I was fully expecting a big-ass castle to be here in the middle. Yeah, it definitely doesn't look like that's the case, though. I don't know if I want to set up in the Redwoods just purely because of the Thylacolios. Kill this bastard. There's multiples of them. Get them, fellas. Let's get the Raptors. All right. Oh, there's another one. Nice job. Any more? Alright, I don't see any more. Let's grab the poo. Okay, yeah, I thought I was thinking there was going to be like some bigger... Unless this is it here. Oh, it is. Yeah, there's the big ass castle. Okay, I might set up here. Oh, man, i got to go back for our Dinopithecus. I was going to take the Cinemacrops and just explore with that, but I don't have any cryopods, so it's going to be a pain in the ass. Maybe? Is here a good idea? We're not near any obelisks. That's the only thing. Is that a terabird? That is a terabird. Yeah, we're not near any obelisks, which is my only concern. There's a lot of Microraptors here. I don't- I really don't want to build in the Redwoods just because of them. Surely there would have to be some metal. I think for the time being, we're going to set up in this base area, in this castle area. Main reason being because it's a landmark, I'll be able to actually see and know where our base is. There's got to be a way to get over there. Without swimming. Oh shit, I don't want to fight another pack of them. Just leave those guys alone. There should be a way over there, right? Oh, there's a bridge. I see the bridge over there. Alright, let's head this way. We did just find another pack of Dinopithecuses. So I'm honestly contemplating coming back and trying to tame them as well. With some floating fish. Nice. We've got terror birds after us. We're just going to keep running. We do outrun them. But yeah, I think, I think setting up in this area is a strategic sort of temporary base spot, just because it's a very easy landmark to distinguish from the rest of the map. We know where it is on the map, and like, yeah, we're easily going to be able to get back here kind of thing. And in hindsight, I kind of want to do a No Flyers playthrough of this, but I know doing No Flyers is going to be a pain in the ass because of the fact that we can't ferry resources. These guys are good. They've got like decent weight, uh, unless we just like get a pack of them. You know what I haven't tried, actually? I'm assuming they don't. Yeah, I was going to say, I haven't tested whether or not they actually reduce the weight of resources in their inventory. But after looking at that, they don't. What we could do is we could take a bunch of Cinemacropses. 
because I believe... Oh, sorry, Wings, I didn't mean to throw you, mate. If I take a look at this, we go like that. Wings reduces the weight of metal resources by 50%. So we could always just tame up a huge amount of Sino Macropses, level them all up in weight, and use them as weight carriers because they're small they're pretty easy they'd keep up with us if we're flying i kind of like that idea to be honest i kind of think we might tame up some cinemacropses because if we can do a no flyers run that'd be uh i don't think it'd be dumb i think it'd be kind of fun and challenging a lot of you guys want to see me explore lost island map but like i've mentioned we are i'm thinking of doing a pvp server it's like 80 percent there in my mind because I mean I feel like uh, not exploring this map on a flyer is probably a bad idea because it's so massive I don't know if this map is bigger than rag or not I have a feeling that it's b slightly bigger than Ragnarok I'm not entirely sure come on dude there you go out of boy let's go yeah I'm not entirely sure if this map is actually bigger than than rag I know it's a hundred and fifty square meters or something like that and I I think, I think Ragnarok is slightly bigger. I think Ragnarok is like 163, but I'm not, I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that. Oh, now, isn't that a bloody screenshot for the ages? <laughs> I love that. All right, let's come in here. Let's set up our home. Uh, this is the, this is the castle I think I did a video on where it had the tavern. And I also think there were wild Dinopithecuses in here. So we might have to be a bit cautious. All right, so far we're okay. I don't know where we're going to set up. Whether or not we want to set up in like this township area. We'll come, what if we come through here? What's through here? We've got a drawbridge. A little moat. This is actually a pretty cool spot. Um, yeah, maybe we set up at the back here. Just for the time being. Because, um, I don't know. We I don't know if we'll stay here permanently. Just because... I mean, there's tons of rocks and stuff like that, and terror birds. But uh, we did do a, a inside of a castle build for Primal Fear, so I'm not entirely sure if we want to set up here or inside like castle walls again. It's definitely a cool spot. Let's uh, let's leave these guys here for a second. We're gonna take our single Dinopithecus out. I'm gonna come over here and check just because I can travel a little bit faster because I don't have to worry about. Those dudes getting lost behind us or anything like that. We got some galleys out here. I'm pretty sure I've seen Dinopithecus spawn in here. Oh, we're climbing? Okay, cool. Are we climbing still? Alright, let's come down here. We got a little bit of a farm area. Can he... Are these harvestable? Are these r crops or are they just random bushes? Can I... Okay, thank you, game. Oh, these are rare flowers. Oh, shit. Well, they're rare flowers. Okay, let's come up here. Because I have a feeling that our other dude isn't on uh, neutral. Their climbing mechanic is very strange. Oh, man, that sucks about our iguanodon. We just got him. Um. Okay, here he is. Yeah, I'm guessing he's killed the ter terror bird. I didn't even harvest anything with the bloody iguanodon, did I? Nah, he's got two Mijo Berries to his name. God damn. Uh, that sucks. Um. Make sure you're on neutral. I'm... Ah, oh, man. We needed a herbivore because we needed mushrooms and stuff. Uh, not mushrooms. We needed bloody... V berries and stuff for narcos. Alright, let's take a look. We might have to try and tame up another one. There's one there. I'm a bit worried about going up to him because I don't know if he's got a pack or not. She. I'm going to try and kill her. So dominance. Uh, something else that you guys have mentioned as well that I'm going to try and uh, do is Maywings. Try and get to get Maywings to actually claim these guys. So I might give that a shot as well. I, I think Maywings don't classify as flies, so I might tame up a Maywing. Because I feel like they probably would be the best things to explore this map, to be honest. This monkey is bloody strong, I tell you that much. I would have thought it would be dead by now. Okay. Oofed. Uh, oh, because it's a baby. 
All right, a little bit more f uh, thingy there, health. You don't have any more monkeys around here? I do like the look of this uh, this church. Oh, this, oh, this is I, this is where we found a bunch of Dinopithecuses on the other video. There was tons of them in here. We got some... Is that metal? No, there's just random uh, textured rocks. Uh, I don't think there's anything else in here. Yeah, I'm uh, I'm not sure about this. Oh, That's a 145. Let's get out of here. That's a 145 Dinopithecus. I just... Whoa, what are you doing, mate? Just climb like a normal monkey. That's a 130 and a 145. Can we move, please? We get stun locked so bad. I don't know if they can follow us. That was a 145 Dinopithecus. I am absolutely positively going to try and tame that guy today. That is what we're going to do. Okay, um... Let's do this first. I'm going to pump some health into this guy. If we can get a 145 Dinopithecus, that's going to be awesome. And I, I'm hope if it's possibly a female, they were mate boosted. So one of them was a female. There was a 130 and a 145. But if one of them is mate boost, if one of them is a female, we could definitely go ahead and breed our other two males that we've got here. So let's just, I'm just trying to force feed him some food so we can get some of his health back. How many arrows have we got? 26 arrows. We need to build a trap. All right, let's get on this trap. I'll bring you guys back in a sec because, yeah, we definitely need to try and tame that 145 Dinopithecus. Absolutely. Freaking positively. Okay, guys, I've got the trap parts all made up and ready to go. Uh, the Dinopithecus is just down here. On second thoughts, I'm not sure if this is such a good spot to build a base because <laughs> having wild Dinopithecus spawn on top of us is probably not going to be a good idea. All right, but I don't see them. I did I did walk down briefly and saw their glow, so I'm a bit scared to go down there. We don't want to lose these guys, and if they kill our monkey, we're most definitely dead. There's no way we escape them. So the only thing is I don't know where to build the trap. I don't know whether or not to just build it, like, on this drawbridge. They're like, there's, there's the glow. You can see them just there. I think, honestly, this drawbridge is probably our best bet just because it's the flattest. So let's get the trap down. I've made it a little bit smaller this time around. We're just going to go with this. I want to see how it works. I'm kind of kind of limit testing here. Uh, I'm still going to try and go with three highs just because I know they can probably jump out of two highs. They do do a jump attack. Um, and we are doing it out of wood because, like I said, limit testing. Okay, how many do I have enough? I'm just short. All right, let's go get some more here. How much do I need? I think I'm pretty much set on everything else. Just the wood, yeah. But these trees gives us heaps of resources. I don't know why. But, uh, yeah, I'm just a little nervous about the Dinopithecuses. So, let's get this going. That should be more than enough. See how much wood we get? Like, bloody hell. Okay, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave our Dinopithecus here. I can use the Cinemacrops. Uh, Cineomacrops. Is, a lot of you guys have been saying I've been saying his name wrong. Get out of the way. I'm a bit nervous about leaving these guys here, to be honest. You've got levels, don't you? Let's give you some HP. Yeah, cool. Alright, uh... So we should be good. I might need to get another foundation to put underneath for the ramps, but we should be good other than that. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to trap them, and then I'll probably bring the Dinopithecuses back out to actually help us kill them. Because they're like high levels. They're going to have a lot of health. So let's just finish this up. And then the fun begins of trying to kite them into the said trap. Alright, that's all good. I might need some more ramps, though. Oh, oh, my heart. Oh, you bastard. You scared the shit out of me. Oh, my God. I thought it was a wild one. Oh, my God. Okay. Alright, we're, we're, we're fine. Oh, that was that was a scare. Alright, let's, let's... Yeah, we're okay. Uh, we need some more wood for that, though. What time is it? I swear it was just daytime. Bloody hell. Oh, man, my heart just dropped. All right, we're okay. Okay, let's get two of those going. I'm going to drop those. I might need to make another foundation. 
smack that once. All right, we should be fine. Okay, now the fun begins of trying to get said Dinopithecuses into said trap. I don't have a crossbow. We've got no metal to repair our crossbow. I, was, I can't really do much about that. I am going to gamma up here a little bit so we can see what's going on. And we do have a level up, so we're going to drop that into our HP. I mean, I'm trying to go for 400 HP. Wings, you're a bloody legend, mate. An absolute legend. Can you kill these guys too? Nice. Good job, Wings. Okay. Lifesaver there. I was freaking out a little bit there too, not gonna lie. Okay. So, that should be everything for the trap. Let's get out here and do it. And let's get ourselves a freaking 145 tame Dinopithecus. I'm really hoping that it's a female. Yes, our other Dinopithecuses aren't that great in terms of levels. But that's not really too much of an... Oh, shit. That's not really too much of an issue. Uh, because, like, it'll get us started on breeding an army of them. Okay, let's get that going. I can't jump while crafting. Seriously? Can I make a foundation, please? Always something else. Okay, there we go. Alright, now we should be good. Come on, give me that. Nice. All right, we can snap that there. Uh, I hope these guys make it in. That should be enough for them. All right, I might have to. I might have to extend it by one. Okay, so there they are. There. We have their attention. We're gonna fly high. We're gonna get them to come into this trap. Come on, baby. Okay, beautiful. That's the alpha. Because it's got the glow. Oh, it's a male. Damn it. 145. I kind of want the female. I don't think I can tame him. I mean, he's still got the glow. So where's his partner in crime? <gasps> okay. Oh, shit. He just half healthed us. We need to kill one of the betas. But he's got no one with him. So we need to try and find that other female that was with him. Kite her into the trap. God damn, that hurt. Alright, where is it? One more monkey. I'm very scared to go down there and walk around on the ground. Except I don't see it anywhere. I'm a little nervous. I don't want to... Get killed here. I'm going to gamma up so I can actually see. Okay, there's nothing down there. I mean, it's a 145. We'll still bloody take it. Where is it? Where did it go? They would have stuck together. Surely, right? Unless it's stuck in, like, the church. Uh, hmm. This is strange. I don't see it. Is that it? No, that's a little porthole. Don't despawn on me, big fella. I'm fully assuming we can't tame him up yet. Oh, I'm not going that close. Yeah, one more beta. Okay. So we need a killer. The only problem is, I don't know where it is. Alright, I'm going to run it around for a bit. I'll see if I can find the female, or the other one. I have no idea where it's gone. We definitely saw two of them. We definitely got attacked by two of them. Alright, let me see if I can find this other one. And I'll bring you guys back, if we have any luck. Okay, guys, found a, another batch of them. I'm going to try and kite these ones up to the trap. If I can get the female's attention after she kills this Diplo. And then that should allow us to get this 145. I don't know where... There was two in the in the little township area here. I don't know where the other one's gone. I can't find her. It's getting nighttime here, so I'm going to be a bit nervous about trying to track her down. But I've checked all the buildings. I've checked around the rocks and stuff, and I haven't seen anything. So I don't know where she, where she is. But yeah, I can't find her anywhere. So there's these two, and then there's also another one... Just over there. So I'm going to wait for them to kill this Diplo. And then I'm going to see if we can get them up into that trap. 
Alrighty guys, good news is we have the Dino Pithecuses all trapped. Now, I'm gonna kill these things. And I'm starting to regret my decision of wanting to build here. I think if we're gonna build anywhere, it would be in one of the castle towers. I also really don't like how these guys just get stunlocked. They get stunlocked so bad. Trying to attack. But uh, yeah, we've got all... We've got three of them trapped in there now. That level 90 female from the beach and the little green kid. So we're gonna kill them. And we're going to try and tame up this big boy, the 145. As soon as I can find the bloody gate. Is my... He's not even following us. Whatever. All right. Let's see. Here they are here. So, we need to kill the female. Now, I did build this trap out of wood. I just don't want to aggro them onto the trap. But they... Why did that... Is that... That's not damaging our own. That's us. I might have to replace some of these walls. No, 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 no. You chill out, mate. I might have to replace some of these walls. Oh, this is... Yeah, this is going to take a while. Their mate boosted. What level is that baby? I wouldn't mind a green and... Red Dinopithecus. The baby's level 60. Alright, uh, I might... I might, I probably should have done this to begin with, but I might just replace the rules real, real quick with some stone. Just the bottom layer anyway, just to make sure that they won't be able to break out. I think that's probably the safer thing to do. And I probably should have done it to begin with, but... I didn't really think about it all that much, to be honest. So let's just get some walls here, and then I'll bring you guys back in a sec. Okay. Walls have been replaced. Now, I'm, I'm trying to figure out... If we want to use our Dinopithecus here. Okay, see that hits them. It takes a while. Okay, now they're just floating in midair. I don't know why, but I'll take it. I don't know if I can still tame them. I don't know. I think it's maybe because I changed the walls and they're half S plus half normal. I don't know. I'm going to kill this one. We'll see what it says. I'll see if I can tame the male. I don't know why he's floating there. I swear I haven't broken the game. I haven't done anything wrong, I promise. Okay. Alright, he's being dropped. Do I have any prime? Don't have any prime. I maybe need to kill this baby. It looks like the male's ready to get tamed up, to be honest. So, let's work on killing this baby. If I can hit him. Okay, that's working. Okay, we just got all the prime meat, which I didn't want to get, but that's that's fine. Okay, let's whack this down here. Now, this big boy should be ready to tame. Oh, baby, come on. Give me this 145 booty. Oh, we forgot about his health. Get out of the trap. Bro, you're not going to be the alpha for much longer. You might as well get in as all, all the hits you can possibly get. Okay, that should be enough health for him. All right, let's go. 12% of one prime meat. I should have enough prime here to do it, and we shouldn't have to worry about it spoiling. Alright, I'm very excited to get our hands on a 145 Dinopithecus. We are going to be cruising around in freaking style and power. It's going to be great. We're still going to keep these dudes for sure. Actually, I've got a little bit of scrap metal here. Could definitely use that and um, make a forge or something. Let's put that away. Let's just get our next piece of prime meat ready. Uh, I think he's going to have to wait a while, yeah. Um, I, I don't know if we want to set up here. The the terror bird and Dinopithecus sort of, not spam, but large amounts of them in this area make me very nervous for building here. Because when you log on to Ark, there's that brief time period, like, it's a, it's not a very big window, but there's a very small window where you've, you, you're logging in and you're vulnerable, you can die. Oh wow, actually, up here is really nice. I honestly might sit up here. And then there's like alternating floors for whatever we want to use them for. Oh! Oh! I like this little area. Oh damn, okay. Yeah, I think I might... Is this the same bit? I think I might sit up here actually. This actually kind of just sold me on the entire place. Okay, let's not stray too far from our big boy here. We do have our Cinemacrops, but I'd feel much safer with a Dinopithecus on our side. Okay, he's still not hungry. Alright, I'm going to work on getting this guy tamed up. I'll probably go find the other one. Let's do that. 
Um, I don't think I have anything else. There's a purple drop over here, which I might actually go over and check out. Before it disappears. Can <laughs> and Raptor Claws is here. I definitely need to try and hit up Raptor Claws for some loot. But we don't have any um, flies, so we definitely have to be in our vicinity to be able to get some of that. Okay, we've got a silencer and a metal irrigation pipe tap thing. It's not the, not the greatest. Let me climb up here. Climb. There we go. Out of boy. Yeah, their climbing thing is really weird. But I'm actually kind of sold on that area as a base spot. So I think that's where we'll set up. Let's come back over here though and work on getting this guy. That's our main priority at the moment because a 145 big boy. <sighs> I can tell you what, we're going to pulverize some booties with this guy. Alright, it sucks that he's male. I was really hoping he was going to be a female. There is that 130 female on the beach though. I did find her again. I saw her on the um, on the beach. So I think we might try and tame her because like 130 is pretty solid. I feel like. Oh, maybe I should have kept that wood, actually. Wrap the claws. Can I see you in the sky, mate? I was going to say... Are there two moons? No. Yeah, i got no idea where Wrap the claws is, but I'll, I'll try my best to find him. Because I would like to get some of that loot off him. I'm pretty sure they did say that Lost Island wasn't supposed to have Wrap the claws um, spawning in. So I'm not sure what's going on there, but someone did a fudgy... Alright, let's grab some stone here while we wait. And I can make some forges. Oh man, this is going pretty good. Uh, we've had some close encounters. Uh, the, the female did manage to get some strikes on us. You probably saw our health as we were coming back from the thingy. But we did manage to get them all in the trap pretty successfully. It was funny. We left and the juvenile, like we were standing over there. And the juvenile just kind of followed them in. It was really funny. Okay, he's still not hungry. Uh, did we get the forge? We did get the forge. Can we get any more? We we'll just need to get some stony. I've just also got to find a reliable source of metal that's nearby as well. That's the other thing. So that we can fill up the forges and stuff like that. Because I... <sighs> Getting back to our other set of forges is going to be quite a trek. Like, where is it? I don't even remember. I'd have to go watch the footage. I think it was like 45, 45. Somewhere around there. That's going to be quite a trek to get back to. So I've, I've, I'm on half of mine to just leave it for now and go back to it eventually. And just get the metal when we eventually get back there. But at the same time, I'm kind of just like, do we go back and get it now? Got him. Get out. Out of the trap. I don't know if they're still aggressive. That's, that's the only concern I have. I don't know if he's still aggressive while in the trap. Like, now that we've killed all these baiters, I don't know if he's still aggressive. I'm trying to figure that out. But let's just stick near him, because now that he's gotten his first feed done he should yeah he should want food a lot faster now i would like to have had some mutton for him because he is a 145 but he's actually not losing too much taming effectiveness anyway so it should be fine but yeah this is how you guys go about taming dinopithecus is there uh their taming mechanic is really unique and cool i really really do like their taming mechanic uh same as all the other dinos to be honest on the the new map the cinemacrops and the, the Amargosaurus. I really like all their new taming mechanics. I really wish they would implement some of those for the older ones. I'm pretty sure we are supposed to be getting another TLC for dinos. I, I remember them briefly mentioning something about that on Twitter. Uh, it was probably a while ago. But I remember them saying that they they were going to do some more TLC pass. There's Raptor Claws. I might be able to get some of that loot actually. I remember them saying they were going to do a TLC pass on some of the dinos. I might actually try and hit up Raptor Claws too, to be honest. He's just up in the sky over there, so he's pretty close to us. I don't have any food. Oh, actually, I do. Don't place that. Don't place that again. Yeah, I remember them saying they were going to do a TLC. So some new taming methods, or these sort of taming methods for the other tames, would be really dope, I reckon. I reckon that's... I, I really enjoy the new taming mechanics. They are just kind of glorified passive tames, like the, the Dinopithecus and the Cineomacrops. But the Amargosaurus one is really cool. You like earn its trust and stuff like that. It reminds me of the, um, that, I can't remember what the mod's called. The like immersive taming or something like that mod. I really want to hit up Raptor Claws. Don't fly too far away from me fam. There's a present right there. Once we get this guy, I'm going to take him out and we're going to hit up Raptor Claws real quick. But, uh, yeah, this guy looks like he's in the bag. One more feed, and we're done. Come on, big fella. Come on, mate. I can sit in the trap here with him by the looks of it. Yeah, he's not aggroed on us. I, I guarantee you the moment I do that, he's going to freaking lose his shit and try and kill us. 
Boom, baby. Let's go. 145 Dino Pithecus. I do wish he had a bit of a color from the Christmas event, but it's, it's honestly fine. All right, I'm going to hit up that Raptor Claws present ASAP. We're going to leave our Dino Pithecus here. He should be whistle neutral here so that anything attacks him, he can go after it. Apparently, we're climbing some rocks. That's super funky. All right, let's see if we can find Raptor Claws or the presence at the very minimum. Okay, I see him over there. He does go into the cold biome. I don't know if I can do that. These guys are very slow swimmers. That's okay. All right. We should be okay. I just want to hit up those presents ASAP. Because if we can get some really good loot to start off with, like crossbows and shotguns and stuff like that, we'll be cheering. There's the present up there. I might quickly stop and hit this one up. Take a simple pistol. Yeah, that's not bad. Re Apprentice simple pistol. I'll take that. All right. Let's see if we can hit up as many of these presents as we possibly can. I'm just a bit worried about running into other Dinopithecuses. But I should probably check this guy's stats as well. I just really want to get to this present before I lose sight of it. Okay, there's Dinopithecuses there. If anything, I should be able to outrun him because we do use our jump attack. Uh, our jump ability, I should say. Okay, there's the present. Get out of the way. All right, beautiful. Let's see what we got. Uh, lance, a sword, mistletoe, and a thylacolio chibi. I'll take. I'll drop the lance. I don't need that shit. Okay. Uh, I don't know whether or not we can try and follow Raptor Claws. I kind of re remember the general direction. I'm pretty sure it was like this way. Okay, let's take a look at our dude's stats. 5k health, 272 melee damage. <sighs> He's not the greatest. I feel like those stats are probably on the more badder side of things. But he's still stronger than the other two dudes that we've got. Plus, we now have a bigger pack of them, which means we're going to be able to deal more damage. We've got a Gacha Claws here as well. So I'm going to swap out some of these coals and mistletoes for him and see if we can get some stuff. But there's another present just on the side of the mountain here, which we should be able to get. And uh, and then, yeah, we'll be happy. I think, I don't know. Raptor Claws is doing another round. It's just a matter of finding him, but we've still got the Christmas event for a couple more days. Let's see if we can get this present. And uh, and then we'll go to hit up Gacha Claws, that's what I'm trying to say. Gilly Leggings, nice. Uh, we got a date on, is it a normal one? Yep. Yeah. And we got some more blueprints. I mean, we'll take them. We'll take them. I don't know if it's worth trying to get up there for the other one or if we just call it quits, but I might. We could probably head back down through the Redwoods and see if we can find another one. I just don't want to venture too far with this guy because we don't know if there's more Dinopithecus packs and, and stuff like that. Are you guys finding anything? No. Alright, I might give you the mistletoe. Oh, there's a lot of them. And you can have the coal. Look at these guys' eyes. Oh no, this one's not. Normally they glow in the dark. Okay, we've got crystals over here. We've got another one over here. No, don't. Come back, crystal. I'm pretty sure the Cola Mistletoe uses up 10, if I remember correctly. Yeah, it does. So I don't know if this guy will produce... Yeah, he's producing one more crystal for us. Nice. Is he? Maybe. Yep, there it is. Beautiful. Give me that. All right, let's take a look at what we get. I'll pop him open now. <laughs> Masscraft Assault Rifle, uh, Fireworks Rocket Launcher Skin, and a Bulb Dog. I mean, I'll take the Mastercraft Assault Rifle. I doubt I'll ever use it. But that's a, that's a pretty solid investment. Alrighty, guys. Well, we're going to wrap the episode up here today. We found our base spot. We've gotten pretty much a max level Dinopithecus. So I'm pretty happy about that. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. Subscribe down below for more. And I will catch you in the next one.